coming off a less than impressive win against the Yukon Huskies. The Missouri Tigers are on the road for the first SEC matchup of the year in Lexington. Yeah, the Tigers definitely struggled on offense last week, managing to score just one touchdown while averaging an abysmal 2.5 yards a carry. Luckily for the Tigers, star running back Russell Hansborough will be back tonight, and he could be the spark the Missouri offense needs. However, the Tigers got off to a fast start without Hansborough. As on their second drive of the game, Matty Mock engineered a 13-play, 80-yard drive capped off by a 17-yard Jamon Moore touchdown to put Mizzou up 7-0. Missouri's good fortunes would quickly fade, though, as injuries would plague the Tigers. In the third quarter, leading tackler Kentrell Brothers goes down, and this one does not look good. Losing such a vital piece of that defense, this is devastating news for Missouri. On top of the brothers' injury, both Sean Culkin and Nate Crawford left the game with injuries. Back in the second quarter now, it's the beginning of the Patrick Cowell show is starting. Here on this 14-yard touchdown run, the quarterback makes good Mizzou defense look bad to tie the game at seven apiece. Cowell's dominance continued the rest of the night as a senior finished with 249 passing yards while going 22 for 27. And in the fourth quarter, with the Wildcats leading 14 to 10, Towels finds Dorian Baker downfield as Baker hauls in a spectacular one-handed grab, toe drag and all. Towels capped off his three touchdown night as he connected with Baker once again, putting Kentucky up by two possessions late in the fourth. But despite the Wildcats' confidence, Missouri was not ready to go quietly into the night. Here, Mock puts together a 68-yard drive deep into Kentucky territory. But just as the Tigers did all evening, the drive sputtered out and they had to settle for a field goal to pull them within eight. With the game in its final moments, Kentucky picked up a crucial first down to ultimately seal the 21-13 victory and approve its record to 3-1 on the season. Despite totaling 338 yards, the Tigers' offensive woes continued as they only mustered up 13 points. Yeah, and with four new injuries to the Tigers, things are not looking good for the future. Well, the Tigers will be back in action next Saturday, October 3rd, when they play host to South Carolina at 11 a.m. From Commonwealth Stadium, for Matt Horn, I'm David Rothschild, 23 Sports.